Alright, time to continue on with some more of Baldur's Gate. Let's see here, this one right here. Is the one. Alright. So last time we got a new companion. We are now inside some other room. Time for us to get back into the swing of things. Wait a moment, here we go. I should have seen this coming. Let's take care of these methods. To get rid of these methods. Another key here. The body lies upon the table. It appears he has been experimented upon. It is hard to, to tell how long he has been dead. So, I can dance on the head of a pin as well. Sure, you could. Hmm. 
got the other potions? Oh, she does. Sorry, but I couldn't hold that last item. It's on the ground. He's a bounty hunter. Hmm. It's probably best left to me. Lead the foot and all that. I knew there was a fire key here somewhere. Hopefully we'll uh hopefully make ourselves a nice bit of penny out of this. And we'll be back later. Khalid? Khalid? No. no! This... this is an illusion.
from you. I will have the heart of who has done this. I will tear their blackened heart from there. I will. I know. <coughs> Shut up, no more words, no more words, and nothing. I knew him not, but I mourn for your loss. Stranger, nobody, I will not hear your words, leave me. A brave man has fallen here, but, the, but that is no cause to hurl insults at the living. Here, who shall comfort you? Imbecile, a font of nature. What do you and your own know? What can you know? No words, no more words, save your speeches, save your proverbs. The only voice I wish to hear is, is dead, no more. No, no. Sylvanus guide the light to the source. Take this man to what he justly deserves by nature's will. What was given is returned. What was turmoil is now, is now peace. Khalid of my heart, let my love, my love guide the way. We, we must hurry before we are noticed. We must get out of here, this grave, and seek the light above us. Let's go. been for so for some time beyond a the point there can be no raising especially when the body has been has been desecrated we live in a time of miracles and nature allows the rebirth of many that have passed beyond the veil but there's a time when when it is better to go that is the way of things there will be there will be payment for this crime and I shall not rest until it is collected when we are able there will be enough I would leave this place. Jahira, I want to say how sorry I am about Kobe. I know this is hard. No! You do not. Stop calling me child, I'm as old as him. And besides, I can tell you that Kali did not suffer. What are you babbling about, Imoen? I am not in the mood. I'm not babbling. I saw him do this. Kali was dead when our captor started doing these things to him. You saw this? You watched it as it was done? He he showed me. He cut me and he shook me. He forced my eyes open and made me look at He... Stop. I don't want to hear this. He said I should see it so I would understand, but I do not know what he wanted. He would cut and say, do you see? Cut and say, do you see? Be quiet, child. No more. I'm just gonna let these two uh, work their differences out. These guys are. Do for me? Do for me? After all that thou hast already done? But we have done nothing to you, lady. We have only just come upon you. Perhaps if you calm yourself, we could. Thou hast created me in her image, but I am not her. I am not. And I shall ne'er let thee touch me again. No more death to rise again. Not her. He took pleasure in her company. He's beyond that. He's fascinated with death. He showed me over and over.
I wonder if you can't deactivate these. Hmm. It's done. So it looks like she leveled up, so... Okay, so it looks like she's, uh... Jesus Christ. I swear to God, if he dies, I am not going to be a happy camper. I don't know what the heck is he doing. I don't know how long this I forgot how this long this lasts. How well Boo would fare up against Hammond from Overwatch. All right, we're gonna have to reload because I don't know what happened. I don't know why that happened. Fortunately, we don't have to start far. I just can't believe. It. Of all the places to wander off to, you have to pick this spot. Okay, we're not going to go through this again. Right, time to fast forward through this. Although, ironically enough here, uh... I kind of did want to do this, so that way I want to see the different dialogue boxes. So I guess this is... Return whence you came. This is not your place. Thou knows who I am, foul one. Or dost thou mis now mistake me for her? You created me, fool. And killed and created and killed and created. And now I shall put an end to thee. creepy. 
Oh, he can also detect traps too. Cool. scroll so now we're back to here again looks like we're gonna go a little bit more cautiously I can dance on the head of a pin as well as I, I suspected perfect I'll just let him lead. here that uh well, I guess you have to I guess you have to take the punishment I guess unless there's a way you can actually deactivate these traps I mean I don't know I knew there had to be reinforcements down here. Couldn't be that powerful by myself, I said. I'll just put an end to this here and now. We'll see the end of Uranicus and your little guild war before this day is through. You can talk all you wish, but it would do you no good. Everyone in this place has either attacked or tried to lie their way into my confidence. I will not believe you. To take an ally from the heart of the beast would be foolish, to say the least. You'll not escape without a battle arrow. Your master dies above, and you shall join him. Get out of my way. I don't want to fight any of you. I just want to leave. You and your guild die, no matter your words. Looks upward into the welcome glare of daylight. Such is your relief that you barely notice the debris at your feet. The remnants of a battle fought only moments before. Surveying the carnage, you hear a scream of rage. And a massive explosion collapses the passage behind you. The sounds of combat greet you as you struggle to your feet. The fight, it seems, is still going strong. I carry two 
you dare to attack your right. Do you even know who you are? Well, listen, glad we're out of there. Well, that was short lived. We must overcome him quickly. Enough. I have the time for this. You will cease your spell casting and come with us. Your pathetic magics are useless. Let this end. Our numbers are many. You may take me in, but you will take the girl as well. No, this cannot be. The murderer of Dinah here flees from righteous butt kicking vengeance, and he takes Imanen with him too. Something must be done. We must find this evil wizard. All that is goodness cries out for this. Even little Boo, although he cannot cry quite so loudly. I find it odd that Aaronicus would leave his own volition. And why take Imanen when it is he so obviously interested in? Perhaps he expects us to give chase? We must step carefully then. We know little about him, whom he was fighting, who took him, or even when we were. We seem to be drawn into machinations not of our own like making. No, we must go quickly and save our friend Imminent. The wizard may be over her evilly even now. Do not be foolish, Minsk. We must know our enemies and the extent of our danger here before we rush into anything. The druid is right, my large friend. The wizard obviously had great power, and I doubt we have even seen the last of him. Perhaps we should see if allies can be found here. Um, you know, so, something feels like, yeah, I've got unfinished business here, um, yeah, I mean, that's great we found our way out of here, but, uh, the thing of it is, is that, uh, there's still stuff to do here, so it is safe to say our job here is not quite over. There's also one other little thing that kind of disturbs me. Why take the girl if it's me that uh, Aranikis is so interested in? Hmm? Get me out of this hell hole. Oh, surely you cannot be my captors, come to torment an old man with his glass prison. You look like none I've seen before. My name is Friend Nidin, and I've been held in this glass bottle for some time now. Why? I do not know, but I fear it is to be magically experimented on. Help me! There is a key in one of the chests that will open up this door. Please hurry! There's the key. Well, that was that was easy enough. See, I suspected that uh, there'd be more stuff.
No, I am seeing nothing of my captor since my arrival. Only his servants. I am afraid I know little. I cannot wait to finally be free of this horrible place. Thank you for allowing me to follow you, my lord. I'll say to it. Fleet of foot and all that. You know, I suspect it as such. And I think there's an achievement attached if I bring him back. You know what? I wonder if I can speak to him and let him just tell him to sit tight for a while. Because what I'm afraid of is unless he can't die. Still plenty more. Very well. Hi -ya. Did he just say hi ya? Okay, she has the least amount of room. It is done. Ah. Go. And this guy's slow enough, so. I'm gonna shut the door behind him. Okay, I just want him to stay put. Because I don't want him to get killed. Because I have a hunch here that there is probably an achievement attached to him. I mean, I'm just guessing. You point, I punch. I think I'm just gonna go solo here. Right, it's safe to cross. Oh, there's another trap there. Huh. Let me have a Okay, so who leveled up? Oh, I leveled up. Nice. Oh, not again. He's in panic. That explains why. That's a good thing he drank a potion. Well, at least he's out of harm's way, which is good. Where is he going? Dude?
where Minsk must be laid soon. Who is? I'm too young to have. Who says that he was just doing his job? English servant awaits. Okay, that's a lot better. Give me some it's done. Whew. I'm one there. Oh, there's a throne here. Besides, I have another portal to go through too, so. He does. So that is incredible that we are carrying more potions, but uh actually we're getting more rather. I said, I suspected as such that there'd be more here. Right, so we gotta make our way back to here. <clears throat> oh, 
Fortunately, though, here we'll be able to rest in the uh, ex mistress's room. I guess if that helps, honey. So, who's equipped with what, though? He's the only one without splint mail, so... Oh, it's mail of the dead. Again, it's a lot more powerful than it's current mail. Jump on my sword while you can, evil. I won't be as gentle! Where are you going, Live by the sword. dude? Live a good long time. I get everybody here. Healing here. What do you want? Rinsk and Boo stand ready. Sorry, but I couldn't hold that last item. It's on the ground. I see. Hmm. Interesting. So it takes us back to here. Huh. Well, let's go get our friend and let's get out of here again. At least I know for a fact he's still alive, so that's good to know. At least it's going to be a much shorter distance this time. Alright, let's go. Well, so much for that. I 
Okay, this time for real we'll be done. I guess there wasn't an achievement attached after all. I must apologize, but I can carry no more. I have set your item upon the ground. soon. I still got space too, that's right. How to do it for now. Wait, if it must be done. All right, we are out again. Okay, we don't need to reread this. You dare to attack me. Yeah, so now we gotta watch this again. Exactly, is it unlawful if you're using your magic for good? That makes no sense. Enough! I have the time for this. You will cease your spell casting and come with us. Your pathetic magics are useless. Let this end. Our numbers are many. Overwhelmed. You may take me in, but you will take the girl as well. Alright. 
Where in the bleeding blazes did you come from? I can hardly believe that the bleeding mage went crazy he did. As if a guild worn at color wasn't enough. I think I recognize the place. Like I told you when we met, I think this is at color. Is that right? Is this the city of coin itself? Aye, it surely is. And the fight between the wizard and those men. You saw the whole thing. Aye, the wizard was angrier than a dragon, blasting these men in black. The leading wizard killed them all and took half the promenade too, before he stopped. Promenade? Aye, this here be Wild King's promenade, center of train and such in the city. Nay, they were all in black and swarmed with their daggers about an hour ago. I thought there would be trouble, but didn't think they would suffer the most. Imminent? Is that the girl? Aye, she was taken. Don't know where to. Maybe twas the cowed ones come to arrest him for all the magics and the like. Ye are new here, aren't ye? Magic be for a minute, Atkala. The cow wizards make things. Keep control of all the... the Keep control over all the other mages. Unless, of course, he has the permission of the cow wizards to use your magic. Don't know how one go about getting such a thing, though. Imminent. Is that the girl? Aye, she was taken. Okay, let's see here. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna reread all this. It's one of the reasons why smart folks stay indoors at night, though none of the guards will say one thing or another about it. Bad for the image of the city. I know, because I'm close to the streets. There is a war between the thieves and a new guild. Don't know much, but lots of people have gone missing. Not much other to say about that. You need anything else? Take care of this stuff then. Yes, that person was a shooter. This is Afka. No. Atkatla is on the lower edge of the Sword Coast. I wonder whom anger that we should rock here. We should lay low, perhaps in the slums. You might have never been here, but I have. Those who are pretend to travel, Khalid. Khalid and I came here. Well, let us just say I have been here before. I do not know the city well enough to give directions, though. We will have to seek out the slums. Perhaps we may find the most imminent still. Khalid. Savannah, let him hear my vow. If I must, I shall empty the city of all within to find this killer. I so do I swear. It is not. It is my wont to do this. Wait, what? What does that say? It is my wont to do this, and I shall see that it is done properly. If you would assist, more the better. If not, be prepared to stand aside. Talk to Lady Beth and see what she has to say. So long, I shall talk. I'm afraid not. Anyone who practices magic without a license does it in seclusion. The Cal Wizards arrest those who don't, such as your own mysterious wizard. How one gets a license from the Cal Wizards to use magic, I do not know. Although I imagine someone in the government district must. That girl was a friend of yours? Well, she was a spellcaster, and both she and the other were taken away by the Cal Wizards. I've heard of these Cal Wizards, spellcasters of the highest order. The only magic users allowed here in Am, I believe. Undue practice of magic is forbidden here, naturally. Where the Wizards would take your friend, however, I do not know. I am not as distant from the workings of the city as some nobles might be, but I heard mutterings of our stable boy and his kin. 
These rule the night in war against those who would take it from them. It would not be unusual for it to spill into the day. Not much, my lord. Everyone here in the promenade was quite frightened when the wizard began fighting those men, the ones in black. Fire and lightning had us all running. And much of the promenade here has been destroyed. It is good that the wizard was rested for his reckless, recklessness. Bouncer, dude. Declare yourself. Move along. I think at some point here we're gonna go to the bouncers. We'll be able to go and see. Like you got a whole lot of wealth, sir. You're here to find a new son, are you? You have my greetings, faithful. Let's see here. There's really nothing here that interests me, but we found. I'll see you done. Down in the seven veils, huh? Trisha, see what she has to offer. Hello. Oh, lovely. Yet another member of the male species come to drink himself into a stupor, no doubt, and bump upon me perfectly clean floors. Hmm. What be exactly that you want? It's safe to draw you in, didn't it? Now, don't be bothering me with useless questions. I only stand here so long as helping you stunt your man. Yeah, 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 I've heard it built before. Human elf dwarf, yeah, all the same. Walking about with a swagger like ye on the place, and nary brain to be found except what twists your legs. So, you have an inclination to actually buy something, or was you thinking that instead of taking your male attitude elsewhere? Of course I mind. You think I have nothing better to do? You want questions answered? Go find some uncle or some such and leave me be. Fine, but I take your coin up front, and don't be wheeling me for a tab either. Because I'll not be providing you with one. You know, I wonder if you were to speak with a female, and what if she has a different response? Let's see here. I go. Truth be told, me late husband, rest his soul, called the place the Seven Veils. He had them belly dancers working here back then, and while I let them go, I didn't have the heart to change the name but a little. The same drunken sods keep coming here though. Tis like they even where the belly dancers have left bah. I don't know how my poor Richard put up with their like. I gotta listen to much gossip. They're the men here yak more on other people's business than any women I've seen. But surely you can ask, miss. Pfft. <laughs> Nay, I don't listen to any hogwash about wizards and such. Any word that comes from the men here is only mis menanderings about things that they don't understand at any rate. Hm. 
I hear news that there will be a war on. Everywhere in the city, shadow of these have themselves a rival. No word about them is as far fetched as you can imagine. Guards of the city ignore it well enough for their own safety. And if one's as smart as them, you do the same. Involving yourself will only get you killed. That's my thoughts. Come again as you wish. Okay, so I was right. So she does have a bit of an attitude towards a different attitude towards if I spoke with a female character. You. You're coming away from me. Damn me room. Are you under arrest? <laughs> Perhaps we should go and soak your head with a bucket guy before you attempt to address me again. A puny human dressed up as a mighty adventurer, I'd say, har har. Did your mama let you out from under her skirt, little one? Bet you're running back now. Ha! <laughs> That'd be a good jest, Mankar, my friend. Ha! A good jest, says Smelly. A good jest, he says. I'm on. You tell your stink and fart smelling imp to stop calling me Smelly. The name is Semelev Ork Slicer. If he does it again, I'll smash him into impish goo. Smelly is threatening me again. He is threatening. Calm yourself, Pookie. As for you, you barbarian knucklehead, threaten my familiar once again and you'll spend the rest of the evening as a toad. Am I understood? What? You dare besmirch the honor of smell of ox life, sir? I will. Enough! Blast it! I tire of your bickering. Now as for ye, little human, you best take yourself somewhere where you're more welcome. This bar be big enough for only us and nay more. You can take your dragon and shove it where the sun won't be shining, you blasted little human. I'll nay you associate with a quivering weakling in my own bar. So be off with ye. Ha! You so funny, Menka. Smell of laughs heartily at your insulting manner. Really, Mankar? Is this all necessary? Must you agitate everyone who comes into this bar? Blast it right then, most. We be celebrating, Brandon. And I'll be damned if I'm going to drink while the order on yon human offends me nostrils. Now be off, human, before he has a taste of me axe. You'll take where I give ye. Come, my friends, let's teach the whelp what it would be to cross mankind on his band, eh? Have at ye! this once more because I don't want to attack me do you even know oh. you you will something tells me I should have saved so God child you have escaped you are more resourceful than I thought okay so it looks like there is a way you can skip all this
Hello, hello, welcome to, uh, what time is it? It's afternoon. Then welcome to the afternoon showing of the, t t I'll tell, I'll de bonito. A rousing wave of indifference from the crowd yet again. Ah, oh, well, if I let such things bother me, I would have given up at the stage years ago. That's for the wishes of m most of my audience, unfortunately. At least the occasional dwarf applause. Well, don't, s doesn't swear and leave anyway. Hmm, let's see. Tell familiar woe to tantalize your tears and tempt your time and interest. Ahem. <laughs> Rays of spells and casting well, but always wanting better to sing of nights and days of yore. To leave the robes that, the fatter. A wizard prone to song and prose, though oft accused of failing, I shall sing despite the odds. Will you shut your bloody wailing? Well finished, Mrs. Patricia. You're a fine ear for rhyme, though. I would hope you'd be more supportive of your own employees. I suppose you're sticking to spells and figures. You are security and a financial advisor, not the entertainment. Hit the road if you want a form for your singing. Ah, very well, Mrs. Patricia. Thank you for your indulgence thus far. That was weird. Okay, before I do anything stupid, I'm gonna save it air. There. Now I don't have to start so far back. That's gotta do so this menacing again. But you know, one thing I wonder... I'm probably gonna need a stronger army, so... It's a good thing I saved! So let's just get out of here. Like I said, it's a very good thing I saved, so... The store behind this door is small and smells only sundries, trinkets, food stuff, or other goods of no real interest or value. I said to the Baron, honestly, sir, you must learn to control yourself. Really? You're so brave. Well, yes, I couldn't let that ogre push people about like serfs. Well, that was mildly amusing. Good tidings to you, young wayfarer. Welcome to the Mithrest Inn. How might be of assistance? Nothing of interest, sir. This is a quiet place, and our customers prefer it that way. Certainly, sir. Alright, so how much gold do I have? 1200. As soon as I find a store and sell this stuff here, I'll have even more. It's probably best left to me. Let's see what Hess has to say. Well, you look like the sort who has more than two gold pieces to rub together. A good business to you, my lord. I do not recognize you, I think. Would it be impertinent for Hess to inquire as to your name? Well bet, and a pearl to you. Feel free to peruse my goods and ask questions, naturally. As you wish. Unfortunately, my stock is not what it once was for the troubles of late, but it is still a good selection.
That's right, none of my characters are spellcasters, so... thought the Kaln ones killed whoever used magic. You think they imprisoned them? Aye, you best stay clear of them. The Shadow Thieves are in a war, I hear. Although I know not with whom, chances are they're in a spiteful mood. I have little taste for magic, but sometimes an item of that nature comes to, to my possession. You could try the Adventure Mark for such things. I see. I wonder if he can get a Mail also. No, but she can. Which I find a little strange. Oh, but this doesn't make a difference. So I guess we'll have to resell it. <sighs> Boy, this stuff is so expensive. At some point here, we're going to have any use for these keys. I hope this is worth it. Let's see what the bookkeeper has to say. Welcome to my humble establishment. Wow. I think that room right there, we're just going to have to wait till later. Because as of now, they're pretty powerful and, uh... I'm not going to bother wasting time with it. Anything you need, I can likely provide, I assure you. Mira, proprietor of this stall and its wares, you've been delivered by Pearl to me, I think. Have a look at my stalk and ask me whatever you wish. The wizards? Ach, tis red ink to even discuss them. Magic is foreclosed here and I'm, and I know little of the wizards and their kind. Shadow thieves? I know little, lord, and consider myself a bur for the lack. All the crime of the city can be attributed to them. I sometimes have a bobble or two of such a quality in my words, but not often. But of course. You call this magic? This just looks like exactly the same as the other stuff. surprised that I can't use a large shield. I find that very surprising. All oh, because I'm not strong enough. What is it?
fury of arms. Hold! This town has been closed for your own safety, citizen. The circus has been closed until this matter is resolved. Is resolved. We're not exactly sure. There was no problem until the show was scheduled earlier in the morning. Apparently, the show began well enough, and that's something I could. Nobody has come out of the tent who went in for the show, and everyone we have sent in to investigate has not come out either. Foul magic, no doubt, is involved here. We are waiting for the Cal Wizards to arrive. They will be able to solve this, I am sure. Well, we have been told that one of the animal trainers started out after the show began. We have not been able to find him yet. Very well, then. I'll not stop you if you wish to risk yourself, citizen. You were warned. It is no risk. Not so long as we have swords and braveness to the brim of the tall glass of goodness. Right, Boo? We should be careful. There is no telling what is going on within the city. Can't handle it. Be prepared for anything is what I always say. A wayfarer has come to amuse Kala. You must answer a riddle naturally, or, I'll, or I will allow you to pass this bridge. Are you ready to hear it? Because it is symbolic of your progression to enlightenment and understanding, fool. Are you ready to proceed? Kala does not reveal itself to those who are not worthy. Are you ready to begin? Excellent! A princess is as old as the prince will be when the princess is twice as old as the prince when... Blech. When was the princess's age was half the sum of the president? Which of the following then could be true? Hmm. Hmm. I always hate these kind of riddles. Let's see here. Princess is old as the prince will be. When the princess is twice as old as the prince was, when the princess's age was half the sum of their present age, which of the following then could be true? Hmm. Okay, well, assume we'll start off at 20, all right? Twice as old as the prince was, when the prince's age was half the sum of their present age. I'm going to try number two. Wrong. Haha. <laughs> The prince, I'm afraid, is 30 years old. The princess is most assuredly 40. Begin to be now, listen. Now, shall I give you one more riddle? The poorest have it, the richest need it, but if either were to eat it, they would certainly perish. What is it? Nothing. Ah, you are correct. The mighty Kala respects those with most edge on a quick mind. Prince, proceed across with my blessing. What's funny is that the first riddle, I actually was right. I did say 20. But I should probably be paying a little more attention, though. Let's see, is there a way around? Who are you? Oh, whoever you are, you must flee this place at once. He's, he's killed everyone else who has come into this place. Almost. Oh, please, run! Kala, oh, I don't know what he's done exactly or how... But everything here is an illusion, but it's magic that can hurt you if you believe in it. Oh, you probably don't understand, do you? I I don't know what he's done to the tenant or with the others who have come in, but the deaths are real. You must run. I, I'm not a monster, and I'm an elf, a winged elf. Or at least I was. This, this covering you see is some kind of illusion, but if you believe in it, then it becomes real. Please help me. Now go before something happens to you. I beg of you. I come from a race of winged elves, though there aren't many of us left. From Fainted Delhi in the south. My wings were cut off a long time ago, though. But that isn't important. This place is too dangerous. Go back to the city and warn everyone what is happening here. You must flee. Oh, I hope you don't end up like, like the others, but alright. My name is Airy. I work in the circus with my Uncle Quail. I don't know how exactly what happened, but everything changed a few days ago. Everything became chaos and turned into what you see here. Although it all isn't real, it's an illusion. The minions, they all say they serve Kala, so I know he's behind all this. He's an illusionist in the circus, but I don't understand how he was able to do all this. 
He must be stopped before he hurts any more people. Please, if, if you release me from my chains, I can help you stop him. You, you need the key to these chains, but it won't work. Look like a key. There are a couple of commoners in the north side of this chamber. Don't be fooled by the illusion, though. They are monsters. They have a sword, which is actually my key. If you get it from them, I can remove the chain and regain my normal form. But please be careful. You, you can't trust anything you see here. Let's start with you. Oh, I am a simple woman. Who are you? My, my name is Hannah. I came to the circus with my son, although he didn't come to the tent with me. Oh, please help me. Oh, I don't know. All I know is that I came to the tent to watch the performance. A gnome came on the stage and began to perform some kind of magical act. It was quite silly. It was obvious that whatever the gnome was trying to do wasn't working. His magic fizzled and everyone started laughing. I thought it was part of the act, so I laughed too. And then everything began changing. People started transforming into creatures and then back into themselves. The world shifted somehow, and I felt so sick and horrified. I think I passed out. When I woke up, I had been turned into this, into this monstrosity. I, I don't know what to do. My son didn't come into the tent with me, and I'm trying to think what may have happened to him. They're not people. They're vicious and dangerous. I've seen them kill people. You must stop them. No, no, I don't. That woman over there seems to know something about him. Perhaps you talk to her. All right, but please do be careful of those peasants. It's probably best to me. I'd like to know what kind of circus this is. Pleasure slave? I am here to serve. Welcome, Lord, to Kala's realm. Be thee not of impure mind, for surely Lord Kala shall destroy thee. Be thee not of impure heart, or thou wilt surely destroy thyself. Kala is the one ruler, the one true being. Kala is beyond thy ken, mortal. He is the beginning, he is the end, he is our god and our king. Tremble before him, and he may take pity on thee. Bow before the will of thy betters, mortal. Kala's rage is awesome to behold. Let not thyself be found in its path. Worry not, lord, for Kala has already found thee. Continue on thy path, and if thee should find favor in Kala's eyes, and thou shalt surely be granted an audience. Uh, whatever. Like I stated before, I wonder what kind of circus this really, really is. Congratulations, Ken. Kala is most amused by your progress. You may live as long as you continue to provide such entertainment. Are you ready to proceed? Fool, your process of discovery is part of the fun. As to Kala, he is the lord of this domain. Ere long, he shall be your lord. Are you ready to proceed? You do show some courage. Go then. You must get my shadows. If they lose my other beasts, shall strike them down. If not, the task shall fall to you, my 
machines. The circus now truly begins. Oh, weird little man. Oh, weird little man. Give me some direction. What do you need? You there. I am not what I'm seeing to be. It is me, Quail. Some of these beasts are illusions and some are real. Don't attack the illusions. If you attack the illusions, you'll have acknowledged them, and then their damage will become real to you. Uh-huh. Well, we didn't know, so... for the pleasure of the tall folk, but I bided my time, and I was promised a world I could rule. And am a mage is a criminal and a gnome is a spectacle. In this tent, in my world, Kala was the master, where none would dare to laugh. Indifference killed those fools from the circus. I treat them in death as they were to me in life. A gnome gets no respect. I just wanted people to look up to me all that I have done. The gnome is dead. How is he able to perform these great feats of illusion? Have to remain a mystery, it seems. Oh. Uncle Quail, you're okay. Ha! I knew Kala would trip over himself eventually. I'm just pleased he despised me enough to play with me rather than dispose of me like some of the others. What would I ever do without you? I, I think you need to find out, my dear. I've taught you everything I can. It's time, Aerie. Time for you to learn the rest on your own. You are the wisest and the smartest and the kindest man I'll ever know. I always and always, my dear. You changed it, but I can't keep you here. Can You can provide for her better than I. Perhaps you will take her with you. You would? You would have me travel with you? I would love to, but... Oh, Quail, I would miss you. Then you shall... Have to come and visit me from time to time and tell me what you've learned. Go. Go with my blessing, girl. Alright. Take take care of the circus while I'm away. And we got a new member of the party. Nice. Oh, don't worry about me. If you find happiness, maybe the pain of losing your wings will be lessened. Nothing would please me more. Be well, my Aerie. If this friend of yours, if she's in danger, then I'd be glad to help you look for her. It's at least that I... Owe you, no matter what the danger is. Yes. Oh, nice. Hmm. <clears throat> Excuse me. A traveler's robe. Okay, so she's gonna need bullets for sure. Quail's well, anything else useful to say. What do you need? I thank you, my good man, for helping us. Kala was a fine illusionist, but just more deluded than anyone knew. Take care of my area then, will you? Hmm. Cross the Kala wizards, have you? Beware, they have deep roots here in Atkala. If they've taken someone, that person is gone. Best just to accept it. Your only other chance would be to get help from an organization just as powerful. Not much. They rule the docks, so some say, and the local guard won't even go there. Probably the safest part of town, if you ask me. I heard some nonsense about someone challenging them, but I don't push to stock it. The Shadow Thieves have as much power as the Cal Wizards, you know. If someone's challenging them, the Blood Scalp, that's what they call their leader, I hear, he'll deal with them sure enough. I wouldn't get involved if I were you. Oh, let's talk to him. I just wanted to thank you, citizen, for doing such a fine job. You saved us more than a little trouble with that gnome. The city thanks you, truly. 
Well, they would have imprisoned her wherever they keep their magic using criminals, and they keep the location of their prison a secret. Sorry about your friend, but that's the way it is. They are a power here in the city, and they're everywhere you look. If you intend to deal with them, friend, be wary. Very good, citizen. You have my thanks once again. There's a lot of, uh, places to go. Let's head over this way. A weaponsmith. Ah, perfect. Hmm. Have you ever been cheated before? I bet you have. Nobody cheats, Minsk. If somebody dares to cheat me, they're in for a boot-stomping adjustment to their moral value systems. Okay. That was completely random. My time is quick, so be brief, commoner. Cern's former home. Hmm. Let's investigate this matter. What is it? Not a concern. You have all the equipment you need. Step right up! Step right up! It's done. I need a sight of some strong war machine. Watch for thieves in the slums and dock, me friend. Me, I be not worried. Killed three last week, I did. You mean you were pickpocketed three times last week? No, I don't be telling stories about you, does I? It is well, Miss Jahira. You'll not bring Harper trouble to me, Dorsef, good lady. Might I remind you that me days of involvement with your kin are long over? I am not here in official capacity suspicious one. There is no need to worry. With your kin, there is always need to worry. But I should mind you manners. Please excuse me. Music to me ears. There's a customer born every minute and a room soon after. What will it be for ye today? In the can. What's on your mind? Ah, uh, too bad. A friend came from came in from Riet Tevin about a year back. A mage named Terrace. His mule had gone lame, and 
he'd summon a floating disc to carry his supplies. They captured him, of course. Terrors. Should have known better, I'm sure he thought a disc was harmless enough, but those wizards are strict about their licenses. I tried looking for him, but the crowd cloud cowled wizards aren't easy to find. Nobody knows where they stay here, and they never let out where their magical prison is. <sighs> well, sure, they ban on magic casting only applies to the disc. And in M, there's only one parameter for the well-to-do. Coin. You got enough coin, the cow wizards are willing to give you a benefit of the doubt. And why not? They get rich, and if you cause a problem, they arrest you anyway. It's not a bad deal, though. Once you've paid them, they tend to ignore you. Try the wizard Corniel at the government building in the government district if you're interested. It's not an area I keep up with. They run the docks. The man to talk to is called the Blood Scalp. Word has it that there's some kind of fight right now, but who knows? All right. Throw me when your turn, I'm sure. Ah uh ah. -uh. The adventure part's the finest shopping in all of favor. Widest selection, lowest prices, and nary a fancy illustration. Just the goods, fair and plain. Hmm. -hmm. So I guess you can't use a longbow. That's that's a real shame. That is a real shame. You know? And a lot of this stuff is so expensive. So I think on that note, we're going to make our departure. Talk to Gareth. Eh? Perhaps your eyes are better than mine. Do you see any salamander dust here? Timus and Tarnations. I'm sure I saw some here last time. Did somebody sneeze when I wasn't looking? Okay, I stand corrected. The other store. I stand corrected. This is the expensive store here. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't think of this sooner. Well... I oh, know, Dispel Magic for sure I would buy. And I guess Web would be useful too. I'll help however I can. Well, if I hadn't sold that, I wouldn't have sold the scrolls. Now oh, there's always other opportunities, so. So it's not that big of a loss. There's a lot of stores here. So he has an accent. Actually, before I do anything else here, uh... Oh, it's just a scroll.
Arnold, Arnold Aeneas, be a fine dwarven name. If ye being take issue with it, perhaps ye nay be buying me armor. Arnold Aeneas, nay being mean to sell to ye. Ah, why ye nay be saying so when ye first coming? Everyone always be wasting Arnold's time. really not much of interest here anyway, so let's just continue exploring the town. Huh, not much to offer here. Talk to this fine gen here. Let's see what he has to say. In the name of the council, I am here to keep order. I'm waiting. This is worth it. And like I said, we're not ready to leave yet, so. the slums currently here. So let's go here. Oh. I'll see to it. Cool. You'd be the one I'd be looking for if I'm not being mistaken. He might be wanting information about all the young lass arrested by the wizards on your arrival here, eh? You're talking about Imanen? What do you know about her? I've heard of him, at least a little. He is a man with many connections amongst the underworld in this city. A man of his word, too, as far as this, that is worth. You'd be a different man. You'd be renowned enough that someone might be willing to find this Imowin for you, or maybe this wizard who held you. Either way, they both went to the same place. Cool! I know it's very little myself. I can, however, link you up with a group that knows. Or can be found now. Might this be not the best place to hold such a dialogue? I may have a place that would suit far better. It'd be just a short walk for me. Why don't I take you there right now? Unless you have some reason for not wanting to come along. <laughs> I have no interest in setting up a trap. It'd be more profitable to serve. I will speak no more. Come with me, and you can decide whether to enter me house. My lord, I see that ye were able to keep up with me all right, eh? I was afraid I'd lost ye. Yeah. Aye, I'll be doing that as quick as ye blink. I'll tell ye straight that I know a powerful group that can be helping ye. They can be fine. 
Vampire and the Wizard and the Young Woman both they can. But they can be doing far better than the Talon, my friend. They can also affect a rescue of your last to boot. Best I cannot tell you. Rest if mind that they'd be willing to help and have enough power to challenge the Cal Wizards. That all you'd be knowing to know. It may seem costly, but I think the danger of crossing crown fair pricing if you think about it. Twenty thousand gold pieces for that help. Perhaps you have spent much in the past and well again. Sure that there'll be work in the city for you. Or perhaps some of your expenses go to sell. Coo! Is this guy a pigeon? Because he's saying coo all the time and it's really getting annoying. There'd be many places to sell as well as buy. Our Ladrian upstairs is as good as any. He may have a few items he made as well as I think. You might think so. But the offer I make is as good whether you... No, 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 now or not. You will come to see the reasonable nature of it, I am sure. He may be right. I would take someone of power to find good information on the Cal Wizards. This may be our only opportunity to find Imoen. Spend not a coin now, then. Seek your fortune about the town, but remember that there is your help. Strangers are not always to be feared. There be no aid elsewhere. Raise a coin or nay, you'll come back, and I'll be waiting. You may want to speak to Ardell and to help you out. Good luck! Russ will be waiting for you outside. He's my nephew, and he'll show you to the Copper Coronet. You'll find work easily enough there, he will. There was a girl in the Copper Coronet by the name of Nadia. She might have some work for a fighting man like yourself. Fare you well, then. And give me grace to let Diana if you happen to buy him. Eh? The deal is made, and you have a goal, albeit a distant one. Your new friend has assured you that passage to Imoen can be bought. Though you are certain the final tally will include much more than gold. Any help is welcome, however, and while the cost may be steep, your path is clear. Finding Imoen will lead to Irenicus and to answers long overdue. child allow the fool to make his judgment. Why was this man not gagged? Did he not slay four of you? We dared not approach. Uh, regardless, in the end, he came willingly. What should be done with them, sir? They are deviants. Let them rot in spell. strong fighter like yourself might be of use. You want me to show you to the copper coronet? Okay then, make sure to stay close, because I don't have time to wait for you. Here you be. I'm sure you can find the rest of your way from here, eh? Off you go! All set to fucking adventure. Are you supposed to be tough or something, eh? Oh, of course not. You're a goody goody, ain't you? An adventurer prancing through the forest. Poor oh, baby, poor little boy, going to run home to your mother, eh? Oh, yes, you are a scary one. Ha ha.
Oh, sir, is it? Haha, <laughs> I was right. You're a bleeding coward. Admit it. Why, well, hey, that sounds like a bleeding challenge. It does. I have no fear, you dolly boy. How about that? I, you want to fight? Yeah, that boy looks like he wants to fight. No one said he was smart, eh? Ha. Huh. Yeah, we're the best, Amalas. Oh, Ken, is, is this really nice? Can't you just ignore him? Tell me, hey, Surly. What? What is it? I got some here, some gold for a fight, and a loser to be, sure enough. Bah, there's no need to yell so loud, Egypt. Fine, fine, I'll have to be in me. Once I see your gold, that is. All right, then, friend. Let's step into the ring, shall we? Just got blown up to bits. You are you for hire as a mercenary? I mean, you look capable and hardy, like you've had formal training. I need a strong hand to help me. My land is under siege, and none of this rebel will aim me. And after all I've done for their kind to you. please, can you assist me? Well, nothing really. Some people are just more privileged than others. It is not my fault, but I do my part to help those beneath me. You think they would be grateful? No, it's not like that at all. I just, I do what I can. I try to be a good person. These foppish snobs that hold themselves above everyone makes me ill. I have no respect for the hard life that poor classes endure. I help when I can, but I won't be able to in the future if my lands are sacked. Please, will you help? There is no time. I only hope that the attackers have not made it inside. If they have, they have breached the inner courtyard. They will be hard to rout. I will tell you what secrets I can. Perhaps you will be able to sneak in and attack from a more vulnerable spot. I hope Father is alright. He will not leave. Should I travel with you? I spent a few weeks slumming, and I'm quite capable of opening the out lock. I had to pick three just to get out of the main keep. Auntie doesn't like me leaving at night. But how else can I donate to the poor and not be noticed? They have pride too. And I really shouldn't be with them. Wonderful! Do you help people often? I have often wanted to get away from the keep and Auntie's rules. She doesn't understand that I just want to help people. Helping out of this is good! What a nice little girl you are! Would you like to see my boo? I think he approves of you too! You speak as if unaware of class distinction, and yet your manners exude it. A sign of immaturity. Perhaps adventuring is not the place for you. Here. I'll mark the location on your map. We should head there immediately. Be careful not to be spotted. I hope everything's alright. I've never heard of it. I think. Well, danger doesn't really scare me. And I know some magic myself anyways. I could be of some help to you. What is it then? Certainly there's no move for Charles to come back tomorrow. Don't count on it. It's probably best left to me. Alright, so we got a new companion now. So where to now, fear this evening? I have to just get moving and decide on a plan and never again say something like don't rightly know. You sound like you were dropped as a child. Or kid. I I'm sorry. I do not wish to cause undue strain on our party. I am really a bit stressed, and no doubt you are as well. I agreed. Although we have all suffered much and the mood may change, I'll try to be civil by your side. Oh, the exit's over there.
All right, I think, you know what, this is a good place to stop for right now, so. Create a new save here. Perfect. All right, thank you to those who watched. I will see everyone next time.